All right, what's up, Hot Squad? Welcome back. So it's now time for my last hot mega reaction today, and it's Zephyr's recap reaction to Justice League, and it's called "How Seth and Wolf Made Their Father Lead Lose Their Own Movie." So Hot Squad, without further ado, let's jump right into it. Last hot mega reaction today. Thank y'all so much for joining me. Love you guys, and let's get it. So the scene starts when the Frog League are recovered from their loss against <laughs> Superman. They failed the five minute white boy challenge. They thought they could pull up with Superman with a squad like this and walk out scot free. Stupid! Get your wells! <laughs> they start prepping for the battle against Stephen Wolf and then Batman hits this. Since Superman got domesticated by the white woman, we need someone to destroy <laughs> the white woman. Cyborg. I'm leaving it to you. What? <laughs> when I tell y'all I can't even make this up anymore, we are not even 30 seconds in the video and they already confirmed their failure. Yeah, the same <laughs> guy that said, let's punch Superman with T-Rex arms and push him down some stairs. That'll show him. He's calling the shots. What? <laughs> and being this sorry has to be a skill. You've got to give him their props at this point. This man Cyborg going to have y'all pulling up like what this. What you going to do if up on you? Hmm? But I don't even know why Batman is allowing this. If it was George Clooney's Batman, I could make him easily. I just gotta be oh, like, no. But you? I don't know, fam. We just gonna move on. But they get prepared for battle, and I'm telling you, they are not ready for this whatsoever. The Flash doing this breathing meditation, you can tell he has never done this in his life. Like little baby warming up before the basketball game. We know you never played. Who the hell does you oh, watch before a game? When we get to Stephen, we'll see Dome, we get the 4K wallpaper of all the heroes. 4K wallpaper. This would be so hard if this was some actually good superheroes. And I know people saw this scene, and they're like, huh, Zack Snyder finally saw the true potential of the Justice League. Bro. Is a potential in the room with us? I, I have yet to see Zack Snyder's Justice League. I still haven't seen it yet. Just spent the last four hours watching them get dogged. What potential? <laughs> like, I'm not gonna hold you. Death being pointed at the earth? I'm taking Iguadala over any of these frauds. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Ooh. Here we got the main op stopper, Batman, posted up, ready to get active. Going straight for the heat dome, and he knocks it down. In the moment the barrier gets down, these aliens start hitting a full court press. Batman ain't used to that type of pressure, and he immediately crashes the whip, like my dog. You couldn't even last a minute? I know Bro was tight as hell too. That jet was a hundred racks. No offset. But Batman's only power is the fact that he's rich. So you know he had to pull up in something else. This man starts spraying them niggas on wake up. He's moving crazy. But this part really feel like a video game for real, for real. He in these slow-mo drifts and this nigga starts moonwalking while driving. Nah, this nigga is sick. These parademons ain't no punk ass niggas. It takes one of them to throw their body to the side and it completely turns Batman's rims inside out. First the jet, now the whip. I know he's fast. But these aliens are really about it. They get on the Batmobile and one of them even lifts the hood of the whip. Cop bro perplexed. Straight yeah. racket. How you get caught off guard this bad? Look at him. Shaking my head. Couldn't be my Batman. Only for <laughs> Wonder Woman to pull up with the save and the rest of the league pulls up. Yep. With a clean ass shot like this? Had me thinking perhaps I was too harsh. Maybe they will cook. <laughs> because this man Aquaman is two layers away from his domain. I thought he was going to be like the frog from Shrek. Just like this. But not to my surprise, he's actually cooking up. They even got trash board looking Clean. Uh, no. But one thing I'm gonna give the Frog League props for, they tweaking like this in an abandoned city. If it was the uh, Avengers, they would not have cared. You tell them these buildings are full with five year old kids that have not seen their families for weeks, they gonna be like, oh man. And blow that shit up anyway, they don't even care. And the Transformers, man, they even worse. Out here booming old niggas in slow Damn. motion just for breathing. <laughs> nah, the Batmobile Damn. finally gets taken out, and this man hits the Ejecto Cedo oh, on him. Straight out of Fast and Furious. First to Tokyo Drift, now this. What you know about Fast and Furious, bro? Because I know it's not family. Batman gets up there and starts hitting free stains on him. I'm talking devious licks. It ends up saving Wonder Woman with their own blick. And this man made sure that she saw his ass. He wants to get in there like swimwear so bad. But he's better than the animated series, Batman. Wonder Woman was on his tip the whole time. Please, Bruce, just one time. Oh, no, baby. <laughs> we finally get to Stephen Wolf's compound and Aquaman and Cyborg are at the door. And my dragon radar started tweaking it was talking about some <laughs> I was like nah someone's gonna sell we got the worst duo of all time since Wario and Waluigi and <laughs> Aquaman really has the audacity to be feeling himself talking Stephen Wolf like he Travis Scott talking about some like bro you have never cooked 
Bro. Like, licking them aliens was cool and all, but this is not a fire drill, nigga. This is a real thing. I better see your ass tee up. Aquaman and Cyborg hitting a team attack, and they got Stephen Wolf jumping back like he got jump scared. Boom! The order it. Oh, yeah, I know that. But nah, no way these two got Stephen Wolf falling back like this. These niggas evolving. But before Stephen Wolf could get his lick back, Wonder Woman pulls up, and then Stephen Wolf hits this. <laughs> And Wonder Woman hit that. It's weird. Stephanie was wild wiped her whole race. She was not about that disrespect. She sprints in for a lick back. They hit two clashes and Aquaman jumps in. This step aside ass interference. Only to get punted off straight Looney Tunes. Damn. He clashes again with Wonder Woman and she slashes his leg. And Cyborg hits a boost jump and actually rocks him off. Like what? Cyborg's out of his cotton picking mind. No way this is the same nigga from the Superman fight. He starts spraying and Aquaman tries to make himself useful. Only for Stephen Wolf to eat those free munchies. Mm. Aquaman's a new fraud of the week, apparently. This man was talking mad hot and ain't done shit. Wonder <laughs> Woman jumps in and gets this highlight real ass moment. Slow-mo and all. Like, we get it, man. You fine. Hair perfect as hell, too. I've seen niggas' hair look worse from a gust of wind. <laughs> this shit ain't possible, bro. But Wonder Woman and Aquaman start cooking the 2v1, and the Flash has accumulated enough charge to destroy the unity. Now, all Cyborg has to do is not sell. And look at this nigga staring at this shit like they have all day. How are you so ass? I know good women that deserve the amount of ass that you're giving out right now, bro. Shame and Cyborg ain't enough. We gotta take this nigga's life. And after five minutes of him staring, he's like, okay, on what? Like, you know damn well if you gave Wonder Woman and Aquaman the ISO for that long, they are going to sell. Cyborg hits at three, two, only to get choked damn. by Stephen Wolf. I know he was shook. His little baby arms came out as an immediate retort. You know he was scared shitless. And this right here, I'm not even gonna hold y'all. Wonder Woman tweaking Cause she sees Cyborg get rocked And instead of charging in She was like nah You can handle it Slams her shield to destroy the bridge Putting Cyborg in a ISO with Stephen Wolf Let me say that again Cyborg in a ISO <laughs> Man that boy get it wrong I don't know why y'all got so much faith in him I do not see it I can literally hear his AI spazzing right now <laughs> This man's skedaddles Hits the jets He's in straight fear Look at his face And Stephen Wolf is hard his ass only for Wonder Woman and Aquaman to pull him down. Like, you two really put Cyborg in the what scariest the 10 seconds of his entire life just to get back in the same 2v1 position. Playing bro's emotions like crazy. I gotta respect it. But because of all that Flash is still sprinting, screaming for his life. And I'm telling you right now, if Cyborg is your last hope to the point where you're screaming his name like this, I got some sad news for you, buddy. It's <laughs> over. Wrap it up. Because Cyborg finally starts doing his job. But the moment he can start being useful, definitely is already there. Y'all lost this fast? Embarrassing. I cannot believe they going out this sad. Stephen Wolf gets behind Cyborg, started claiming his set. He hit that. For the dark side. Ready to chop this man's head off only for the goat to pull up. Yup. So. This nigga pulled up talking about some not impressed. Like, oh, damn. Talk to these nigga soaps. All black fit too. He was in the locker room changing his fit. He was ready for the occasion. He ices his weapon and then shatters that hole. Had Stephen Wolf looking at his hands like, Buhan, where's my weapon? Clueless <laughs> ass. Get this nigga a map. <laughs> Superman stares at bro and then hits him with a this. This. Then he crashes towards the wall. Stephen Wolf gets up pissed talking about some. This man is a captain and Manta himself. <laughs> Those Tony and niggas make me sick. This is fine with motion. Power from the sun, my ass. We brought in this shit from the trap. I'm gonna have them pump to eat an ass all off. Raise them with the laser beams. It can burn through everything, even layers of queso's fat if it wanted to. <laughs> Superman hits his man with an easy weave. Launches bro to the floor. Yeah. This is Superman run the fade, and Aquaman and Wonder Woman are glazing. Wonder Woman jaw drop talking about some color. Like, bro, you don't know the nigga like that. Stop. It's like calling SpongeBob Bob. You're weird. <laughs> and the way he's getting done right now is actually. Sad. Someone get this nigga coordinates. There's no way you're this lost. Aquaman sends him flying and then Superman swoops in with the Bop! Sends him flying across the map. And Superman is already behind this nigga and dunks the back of his neck. I know he's feeling crazy right now. Stephen Wolf is on the floor and Superman rips this man's horn off for collection. I'm telling you, once they put the black suit, they become a whole different nigga. Superman starts beating on this man crazy. And this scene right here is why you should have never gave the dagger to Cyborg. This man took so long to actually get ready. One of the aliens outside 
finally realized this dumbass nigga was running in a circle and snipes him out his hamster wheel. And I'm so lost. You told Barry count to three five minutes ago. And now you out here taking years. You should have let this black burnt toast and Teen Titans go. This lame ass nigga do it. And you got this man cyborg screaming, Barry! <laughs> like it was him who sold. Shut up, nigga. I'm sick of your ass. Like, bro, I don't want to ever see this nigga on a team again. If I even see this nigga next to a hero, I'm going to knock his bitch ass out. The league turned yeah. around and looked at dark side. Back turned posing. This man knew it was time. But as we all expected, Cyborg fails. The unity explodes. I saw Cyborg die and I started celebrating. I was praying for times like this. And these niggas dead ass lost their own movie. How do you lose in your own movie? How are you sorry at your own court? And they only got another chance because Flash accessed his old save file. But the Flash is one of the coldest scenes not only in this movie but in all superhero movies in general. I started hearing at the speed of force in the background I was like nah it's that real music man but this man gets back single handedly saves the whole plan and they stop the unity and they finish off Stephen Wolf in the coldest way possible yep. I don't know why Aquaman so geeked as if he did anything in this fight but I'm gonna let Sardine breath over here pass and his head starts rolling at Darkseid's feet and they stand and post it up staring Darkseid down like they want all smoke and I promise you you do not want this nigga's fade Darkseid yeah. is just a stronger Thanos and the Avengers colder than y'all and even them boys lost to Thanos so what type of math is that <laughs> <laughs> but the movie ends with a teaser. We got Lex Luthor and Deathstroke. And Lex out here telling him Batman's government. He definitely got it from Wonder Woman. She the feds. And then he's over there talking about some, don't we make a team of our own? So they gonna get this sorry ass team to fight another sorry ass team. Yeah, I'm done, Roma. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, man, that was great. That was hilarious, man. Oh, man. It's been a while I've seen the Justice League movie. It's been a, quite a while. It's been quite a while. And a lot of people did not like it at all, and I'm with them too. I, that it says like the worst MCU. I mean, MCU. I beg your pardon. DCE movie. I'm trying to catch myself up here. Sorry, y'all. I was tired. I'm freaking tired. So yeah, um, one one of the worst DCEU movies. And yeah, it actually was. But yeah, I'm not seeing Zach Snyder Justice League, but her was a huge improvement to this one. So yeah, this was a great recap. Was that fire? Great recap. So Hot Squad. That is it today. <clears throat> actually, for the rest of the week. Of hot mega reactions, like I promised y'all, all these recaps. So, Hot Squad, if you enjoyed my conclusion, my, my conclusion, my reaction to Zephyr Just Sleep recap, please hit that button, comment, share your thoughts. What is your favorite DCE movie? Who's your favorite character? And also, <clears throat> if you've seen Justice League, Justice League. So, Hot Squad, this is Tardis Hot sign out for, for the weekend. I will see y'all later next week for more hot mega reactions. Until then, safe out the sky. Peace out and have a great weekend.